In Fashion Photo 08 was staged in a 35,000 square foot venue designed by Stéphane Dupu. It was a parking lot underneath the uh, I-95 bridge. That was the biggest challenge really, is trying to transform a lot into an art exhibition. If you uh, elevate yourself from it a little bit, it's separated in uh, three spaces. That are the two main exhibits, plus the uh, Naomi Campbell uh, retrospective. There's custom floor everywhere, there's grass. All together, try to use what was here, the environment, the bridge, the columns, uh, without changing and uh, getting just that volume uh, adapted to the exhibit. was the biggest difficulty, of course. Um, we had done three samples and none of them were coming out good and at the 11th hour we had to make a decision, do we cut it, do we go with it? And I'm so glad that we went with it, but uh, it's real grass, so that's what's interesting. We didn't use anything fake. We had eight days to put this together, which was not at all enough. Next year, we'll, we may do it here. We're going to need probably two weeks, maybe three weeks. It's custom floor, for one thing, can take a week. But we did it in eight days, everything. So nobody really noticed, I don't think. I hope not. Art Photo Expo has landed in Miami during Art Basel Week with a special collection of photographs outlining the career of supermodel Naomi Campbell. In Fashion Photo is the first exposition of its kind to exhibit popular contemporary art and photography by the best photographers in the world. In Fashion Photo 08 features an exclusive collection of more than 250 contemporary works of photographic art by more than 35 of the world's leading icons in fashion photography that are on sale to collectors and art enthusiasts throughout the six-day exhibition. The other fairs are all exhibitors that are pay for booths. We invite photographers and we select photographers through a curator. Uh, this year it's Patrick Remy. And I make a mix of 20 photographers. Some are very famous, some are just young who just start. It's like a fair, you know, you can find what you want in this world of fashion photography. A highlight of this event was a retrospective spanning the long career of supermodel Naomi Campbell. Don't forget the models. I mean, we have photographers, but don't forget the models because they're a big part of the pictures. They had some photos here last year, and people were like, we want that picture of Naomi, we want that picture of Cindy. So they thought, well, it would be nice if the models were actually involved in uh, being part of the Art Basel, which is an honor for us. First pick was to pick Naomi. For me, she's the best, uh, she's the best model ever. Naomi Campbell retrospective is kind of an, um, you know, a, a, an English muse, a, a garden uh, English style. The idea behind it, of course, in a very abstract way, uh, to create a different background for the beautiful pictures uh, that she has done through her career. The Naomi, uh, you know, exposition is fantastic. You have great black and white pictures. You have fantastic pictures of uh, Peter Lindbergh. You know, he's the maestro of the business. It's nice to see her going through um, all the stages in her modeling career, all the different ages. Um, you know, the shots are very playful, which I love. I love this actual parking lot. Out of all the museums I've been to, this has been the nicest transformation, I would say, and the most beautiful art. I like it, I love all the pictures. Beautiful, amazing job. I never thought in my life I could do something beautiful like that.
what does the future hold for this event? An international tour melding incredible fashion photography and unique design unlike any other exposition of its kind in the world. We have the rights to most of the works for a year. So we can, um, they're limited editions, so it's not just one piece, but there's 10 to 12 typically. Some of them are 150. And so we can take them to other cities. I think we're going to Dubai, maybe Moscow, for sure Paris. We'll see.